Greetings, everyone. Sorry that took a little bit long. I was trying to finish a bowl of ice cream. So, here we are. World Tournament 2007. I don't know why I almost said six. That is just a bunch of random keys I typed in chat. To check to see if chat worked. And we are on level three. Because last time we made it to level three, if I remember correctly. I know we beat Frostsaurus, Ancient Gear Beast, and Yamada Dragon. So now we're on Parsash. Glad Attribute, Fairy Monster. Sanctine in the Skyfield spell deck. And we have a decent hand. Set Dimension Wall. Use that for when they attack. Since they only can summon one monster. Hello, Josh. Welcome to the stream. I've been expecting you, actually, because there was something I wanted to um, talk to you about. So, going over footage, um, <coughs> sorry, so going over footage, courtesy of you, of course, I have, I have three parts, and going through the Necros footage, that puts us at about five minutes, maybe six, depending on what the timer says. Um, I'm just letting you know what the case is with those videos. Still don't know when I'm going to upload them, but when I do, I will definitely let you guys know. Or I'll, I'll definitely post it inside my server, so you guys can at least uh, watch it and look back. How do we stand? God damn it. Wait. Yes, because I want I want to check something with the effect. Alright. Damn it. When this controller takes any damage. Okay, that makes this easier then to make sure that. Fuck. Ha! I play dirty, motherfucker. You fool. You fell right into my trap. This is also why no one plays that monster anymore, because of that little drawback. I mean, it's good for, like, stall purposes, if you're playing, like, a final countdown deck, but other than that, not really. Excuse me. That is something else I want to mention to you, Josh. I will give you credit where it's due, because when going over the footage, um, you actually didn't quit when facing the opponent trivia deck at all, and I am actually proud of you for that. You're getting praise because despite getting super frustrating at that getting super frustrated at that deck you did not quit so I'm giving you a prop I'm giving you credit where it's due because a lot of people I've seen face that deck rage quit because of how just ridiculous it is oh, are you fucking kidding me right now are you serious oh what kind of bullshit is this God for stupidity. But not really stupidity, but more or less thank you God for letting him draw when he killed. <laughs> now we get to face him again. Yay! <laughs> I mean... You did lose, though, 
but when I said you had to admit it, I specifically stated you had to rage quit and surrender. So, there's that. Okay, this definitely calls for Dark Room Nightmares. I can do a lot with this hammer, good god. Boof. Meteor destruction, go! Boof. go straight into Parsash, I have a plan because Mask of the Accursed makes it so they can't attack, but it also comes down to are they going to pull it out and when are they going to pull it out. So as of right now, it's a stalemate. He is literally just going to gain seven after attack. So because of this, we're at a bit of a stalemate. Um, Down. Yeah, he really just wasted a cop cap. Alright, now he's going into par slash and then possibly neo par slash, but I'm not going to use it on because he could easily get rid of it. Now we're in a bit of a bind because he can now draw. And not that Sanctuary and Sky is on the field, so I'm pretty sure that gives a bonus effect to neo par slash. I'm not entirely sure I need to read the card. Uh, Desk Koala. Well, he's gonna be drawing. So I'll be able to do all 1800 damage just from him attacking the enemy. No, actually, 16. 2100, correction. as if I'm taking zero damage. The most excruciating pain of all time. And this deal's already over because I just can't find so. <laughs> okay, so now I just need to time this correctly. Fuck. Shit. This is not good. Good, not good. Oh boy, ow. I've been slashed. Honestly, I feel like copycat should be used more because of the whole, oh, it gains the attack and defense of anything it copies. And I think it's a really good effect, but it also comes down to, I understand why no one uses it. And it makes <sighs> you gotta be fucking kidding me right now. I fucking lost. I fucking lost because of this. All because I did not get anything useful. I am not accepting any loses before doing this for my channel. I am not accepting any losses. Until I record this, I will not accept any loss. Oh god, what was it? Oh fuck, what was I so close on? Boris. So you'll... 
you'll, you'll get a kick out of this, Josh. So I was playing World Tournament 2006, and I was facing Horus, the Black Flame Dragon, level 8, and that was, I think, tier 5 difficulty. And I got him down to, like, 300 or less life points. And I ended up losing because of this. Hey, I am not... I am... I only restarted because I am not accepting any losses before doing this for YouTube. Yeah, I will admit, I, I'm trying... Okay. I don't want people... Like, okay, if I record this for YouTube, and people see I lost before recording this, they're gonna have a little bit of questions. Plus, this is... I mean, people are gonna be seeing that I... Like, they're gonna be watching these streams on my channel if they want to see how this was done and the process of which this occurred in. Like... I mean... I can't find the right words right now. That's definitely gonna bounce back. True. True. But I'm also looking at... Going in with no loses before... Um, actually doing the project itself. Plus, even then, depending on the AI, I would most likely have quite a bit of loses before going in. Like when I did World Tournament 2004, however, that had no losses. But when I did lose, and I like I had the um, the bonus video of me losing each and every time and how it happened. Same thing with 2006. I, I'm setting up shop. I'm I'm in the process of doing that. Like I'm playing the game right now. I just don't want to. My OCD will not. Okay, so this will probably help explain a lot of things that I probably should have mentioned a hell of a lot earlier. So growing up, with when I was a kid, I played World Tournament, World Championship Tournament 2004, and my brother and I we would always restart. When it, before losing to an AI, that way it would show that we didn't have any loses. Now there's two reasons for that. One, we just didn't like having lose, we didn't like the fact that, oh, we lost to this AI. And two, depend if you had more loses to an AI than wins and you're trying to unlock their booster pack, you can't unlock their booster pack until the wins ex is more than the losses. So like with Weevil Underwood, for example, I remember losing to him, like, I lost to him like, well over 15 times, because that's just how bullshit he was. And like, I remember losing, yeah, like that, that was the thing. We couldn't figure out why we couldn't get the booster packs because the lot the loses was more than the wins. And it's more or less like that. I wouldn't really call it childhood trauma, but it's more or less that mindset that I still have after all these years where it's like, no, I won't lose to an AI. I don't know why that is. Wait, latency is a good thing, right? Yeah, it's, it's just it's just a force of habit with me. Whoosh. Uh, yeah. I, um. I don't know why that is. Also, thanks for telling me that, because I was actually about to look it up on my phone. Because I didn't want to, like, look away from this. Desk Walla. 
Fun fact, I used to have... Like, meaning when I checked. Yeah. So, like, I have, like... Well, that's just because Switch is just being a twat. That's what that comes down to. Twitch is just being stupid. Bring it on, AI. What you got? What you got? Get your balls up. Come on. Alright, leave me no choice. Go yawn. Alright, AI. You leave me with no choice. Dark Snake. Strike. And because I have Dark Room of Nightmares on the field, I can go ahead and flip up Desqualla, and then finish him off by burning him to death. Now, if I were to switch to my Elemental Hero deck, I'm pretty sure I wouldn't have any problems with this AI because it's just light attribute. Spirits would probably give me a bit of difficulty. Allure Queen, I'm pretty sure, won't give me any difficulty. Possibly, depending on what's inside. Possibly. And definitely because it's going to be as a skill train. Actually, really good. Okay, so we got Yan, Poison the Old Man. Tremendous Fire. Set Zoma and go ahead and set Desqualla. Just in case they play Shining Angel slash Gel and Duo. Excuse me. fucking kidding me right now. What is your obsession with United We Stand? Skull Soma. Just no. I'm using Burn for right now, yes. This is my World Tournament 2006 slash Burn deck. I'm only doing it because I just I just feel like messing around with it. I mean, be grateful this isn't the Shadow Ghoul deck that was originally going to be the um, LP final. Because that is just... Ugh. Don't ask. It's just best you don't. It's, it's exactly as it sounds. It's a Shadow Ghoul deck. Plenty of Special Summon powers, which I was able to get through the Special Summon um, theme duel with no problem, but... Just, there you go. Okay, that's good. I do believe this is game, because they take 1500 from that, but it's down to 2400, and then someone should finish them off. 21, okay. Yeah, there's no way they're getting out of that one piece. done with this AI and then we'll move on to the next one. Hang on a minute. Okay. Alright, there we go. Alright, so Blast Sphere. Well, should I do Blast Sphere or should I do Blaster. Oh, you see Spire on another turn. Hang on a minute. All 
Alright, sorry about that. I had to um, adjust my mic. Set dimensional wall because they're going to be losing a monster to 1400. Then, depending on what they summon, they attack me. I activate dimension wall and then inflict more damage on them. So they're already 66 and then 63. Then, depending on what they summon, we'll determine even more. Okay, Thunder Nyan. Dimension wall, putting them at. 5,400 if I'm doing the math correctly. Battle step, uh, nah. Forty-four. I was off by a thousand. Ooh, another blast sphere. That'll be helpful. Let's give them marsh first. Name Stark Wish. Cool. Oof. And phase. Go ahead and use Ceasefire Just Desserts just for the hell of it. Ow. And ow. Probably, uh, I probably get to use them for their next circle when they summon, but you know, it doesn't really matter. Uh, okay, set princess, I'll do another thousand. Maybe fifteen hundred if they set another face or use United. So, it just comes down to um, what they do. Ow. I'm not really smacking my lips. Like, I don't know what you're hearing that would be classified as lip smacking, but... It's just me opening my mouth and making noise at the same time. That's all that is. It's not on purpose, I guarantee you that. Poison of the old man should have gone off because it would give it should have given me the option to do that as well. So now we just need to figure out what the hell they're gonna do. This definitely calls for just desserts. I can use Zoma to um, attack. See what the hell they have. Because they're not one to attack into me. Which also means I need to attack into them and they're playing a fucking magic cylinder on me. How dare you. What's up, Josh? If 
gonna do already. Um, I'm trying to think on who the hell that is. To be honest, like I know, I know he's in a server we're in, but I just can't think of his name on Discord to save my life for right now. Yes, he's going to duel Artie Ziff, but last time I checked, Artie Ziff is in prison for, um... Fuck, what did he go into prison for? I have a feeling I'm facing an Allure Queen burden deck for some reason. Based off the magic cylinder and the giant marshmallow not staring me in the face. Either that, or they're just trying to stall for right now, so they can get out a Lure Queen. But that's just my guess. Yeah, they're definitely stalling for a Lure Queen. But here's the thing. Oh, Merrick. Okay. Okay, I know what you're on about now. Set that. Flip up Desk Koala doing 1600, I think. Shit. Now I'm pretty sure it doesn't gain attack by doing that, but it does allow the. Oh, goddamn. That really fucked me up. And because of that, all those slip effects don't go off, which really screws me over. Oh, that is just... Uh, yeah. I'm more convinced this is a burn deck than an actual Lure Queen deck, but... I mean, a Lure Queen is an interesting card, or LV card. Because it acts like Relinquish, and you could just grab stronger monsters. And as long as he doesn't put a Lure Queen in defense, I should have this. Shit, I had to say that. You know what, I'm going to give him a taste of his own medicine. I'm going to give him a taste of his own medicine. Cease fire. Now nah, it doesn't feel so good, does he, you little asshole? Punk ass Decepticon. I mean, you can duel, um, you can duel Merrick. But, like, if you're expecting me to stop what I'm doing recording, um, I don't know what to tell you. Like, to me, is like, this is what I'm trying to do. Well, I shouldn't really put it like that, but, like, just know that my attention will be on this versus recording you guys for the Rage Montage. But at least let me know how that goes, or if I, like, missed out on something entertaining. Also, let me know what he plays during each duel. Because I'm actually curious as to what he would, what he uses um, against you. Uh, what did I have? It's not blast here. Shit. Um... Okay. Guess I'll be setting Duskwalla face on them. Need to be careful because I know they have Seize Fire in their deck, so I definitely need to play a bit more carefully around that.
Dark Snake, you're definitely going to be needed for this duel. served his purpose. Go for it. Just means I get to kill you faster now. Is the lip smacking a bit better now that I'm watching how I talk, Squiddy? See that in a burn deck or any deck for that matter. It was an interesting comp. It's an interesting thought mixing um, LVs with metamorphosis because that just means like, oh, we have this card. How can we use it? What can we do to make this more interesting for the extra deck? And I drew deck card figures. Right when I set a fucking blast sphere face down. Right when I fucking set a fucking blast sphere fucking face fucking down. I intentionally said fuck that many times on purpose. Alright, princess. Let's see if you can't do anything. those face downs. I, I just don't. Because with this deck, and because of them using Ceasefire the way they've been doing it, it's not good. Go ahead, take a take. Serve purpose. I don't know what the hell my headset decided to do just then. That is not what I wanted you to do. I hit the right key, you stupid keyboard. Now you done fucked everything up. Well, I mean, it wouldn't really matter because they don't have a hand, but it's still a monster I could have used. And they took my reflect powder, my good card. God, if they blast, if they, okay. Now they get to play a Lord Queen level seven and take any card they want. Well, here's the thing. They're only limited to Desqualo. Here. I'm okay with that. Click. Okay. Go ahead, attack me, Sphere Reaper. I have a useless card in my hand anyway. Yes, because I actually do want to see something. This 
character would be destroyed by battle. Good. So Blast Sphere, in theory, will finish him off. Good. Oof. 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 Absolute zero. Yay. deck just to see if I can't do shit with that. Okay, I'm okay with Nightmare Steel Cage. Not trying to attack anyone. This guy, on the other hand, definitely fuck you up. Because now I have the deck advantage. And you just returned my bottomless chapel. You son of a bitch. How dare you? I had a good play and you just fucked it up. Damn you, you rat bastard. I guess I guess that's scout plane for right now. Get rid of me, I'm Mirror Forest. No, why are you getting rid of all my good cards? I mean, yes, that is the point, but still. Sorry, my sinuses are kind of running right now. I know it's gross, but still. Down. Morphic jar, morphic jar, activate your effect. Why should you know it? Soul absorption. Both my necro faces are face down. Wouldn't you like how do you like that? Well I am going to get a fine grid mosh. Him. Yeah. And then my turn. The lure crane, level five, reveal. Okay. I have a plan for that anyway.
Oh, I'm sorry, were you expecting something else? productive to my plan of banishing shit. You know what? If I'm not allowed to have Banisher, you're not allowed to have her. So fuck you. might be able to do something, but it all comes down to how the hell they're going to do it. The thing that irritates me most... Oh, it's not going to use the effect. Okay. That makes this easier, then. I don't trust you, Nudorio. You can get banished with me. so I can't exactly complain. No. Yay. 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 I lost both my servants. What kind of bullshit is this? Now you're in trouble, AI. 
guess you done fucked up. However, there are cards I have no way of actually getting over. Like Spirit Reaper and Marshmallow, which I'm really hoping are either banished or not face down. I don't mind stalling until we run out of cards, but like, fucking hell this AI is annoying. Not as annoying as the um, last one, but still. Go, Dark Magician of Chaos. Serpent, just in case. be nice right now being able to play a video game but I can't play a video game because the AI is not allowing me to do anything and we're in a never ending soul absorption chain Magician of Chaos, Cosmic Queen. Okay, that's not what I could have. 
Our grand Maji, that's why. I'm an idiot. Are you fucking kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? It's just no. No. Just no. Now my head is really fucking with me, so after this duel, I'm more than likely we get to end the stream. Oh, you son of a bitch. I was gonna be doing... I do Yu-Gi-Oh! on Saturdays. I mean, unless I say otherwise, like, hey, I'm not feeling too well or something, I'll... Like, unless I tell people there's no stream tonight, chances are I'm gonna be, um, doing it. So... Sorry to, um, disappoint, but my head's like really, it's seriously fucking with me right now, I don't know what the hell's going on, like, my vision is just blurring out, and I don't know what the hell it is, like, my mind's, like, just drifting out of consciousness, and I don't, I don't understand what the hell's going on. Cool, we broke 40,000. Yay. You would fucking sorcerer villain like me. Just because I can. So he went through the entire deck, and right when I was about to make a comeback and end the duel, Homegirl decided she wanted to play Swords of Revealing Light and literally deck herself out. That is just... Ugh. Alright, so because my head is seriously messing with me right now for unknown reasons, I am going to end the stream here, and next Saturday, hopefully I'll be feeling better, and I will hopefully resume my beating of Lure Queen 5 along with the rest of Tier 3. So, that's what's going to happen. Thanks for coming, and goodbye.